Hello everyone, this is Victor Campos, and in our last video I talked about downloading the Java Software Development Kit, the JDK, and after that's installed, our next bit of software that we need is the Android Development Tools. So you can go back to your web browser and go to developer.android.com where you can read and watch videos all about Android development. There are three sections that you should check out, which we'll be looking at through the course of the semester. We've got the design section, develop, and distribute. In very quickly, design is where you would go to learn the design language of Android apps, how to make them look good, what are considerations for your icons, and all of that stuff. Develop is where we get the software to create our Android apps, and then uh, also all of the documentation on how to use the code and, and write code snippets and all of that. And distribute is eventually when our application is finished, this is where we're going to go to upload our completed project so that we can sell it on Google Play or distribute it for free. You can check those out on your own. For our purposes, at the bottom of the website, we want to get, we want to select get the SDK the Software Development Kit. This, the Android SDK provides you the API libraries and developer tools necessary to build, test, and debug apps for Android. So it's for Windows, it's for Mac, it's for Linux. You're going to see a download button on the right side. Click that. You can agree to the terms and conditions that no one reads but everyone agrees to. Select that you have read and agree to it and then select your 32-bit or 64-bit versions. If you don't know what type of computer you have, you're safe downloading the 32-bit. If you've got a 64-bit computer, go ahead and select that one. Click to download, and then you'll see a 480 megabyte or so file that is going to download for me in about three minutes. I'm going to cancel that because I've already downloaded it. But what you get when you download is a large zip file. The one that I downloaded, which is the latest one as of this video, says ADT Bundle Windows x86-64 2013-1030. So this was published back in October last year. It's the latest version. And notice that it is a zip file. It's not an installation file. So there's no graphical user interface installation file for the Android development tools. It's a big old zip file. So you would need to, in Windows for example, right click and extract. Choose any folder on your computer, on your hard drive, on your desktop, anywhere, and extract this zip file. Those are the Android tools. I've chosen to extract my Android tools, the ADT, over to my files drive, and there it is. Notice it's an unzipped, uncompressed file. Inside of that, we've got several apps and tools and code, and this is what we're going to use to actually create our Android apps. So we'll look at this in depth in a future video. So make sure you download and install the Andro uh, the Java Development Kit, the JDK. You download and unzip the Android Development Tools, the ADT, and then come back for our next video to talk about the third piece of our software puzzle, PhoneGap.